by Ashraf al Haram the month before and after that. Beautiful chants of Rahmat. This is what the movement, the Muslim, should be striving and looking for throughout his or her life. We need to gain as much barakat as possible, as much rahmat as possible. We need to say no, no chance of forgiveness in our life. We need to spare no moment in which we would be able to gain the salvation from the fire. Why? Because life is very short. We don't know when the time comes for us to leave this dunya. Just before coming to here, I was attending a janaza of a young brother, relatively young brother, who lived behind him, a young sister, with two lovely daughters. When we were attending the funeral, I was trying my best to help his young two daughters to understand where daddy is going to go under the ground. Why is he put in a box? Why there are cottons in his nose? Why he is so cold? Why he's gonna go seven feet, seven feet under the ground? These are all questions we as adults should be prepared to answer or be mindful about as we're living our life. Ya Yuhannas, ittaqu rabbakum. Ya Yuhannas, ittaqu yawman. La yajsi walidu an waladi Jahiluna. 
قالوا سلاما والذين يبيتون لربهم سجنا وقياما والذين يقولون ربنا اصرف عنا عذاب جهنم ان عذاب هذا الله هذا ما does not live just for the sake of living. Does not live to eat and entertain himself or herself. There is a purpose for our living, for a purpose for our life. That purpose is to prepare ourselves for our real life. So let us be ready emotionally, intellectually, and also as well as, well as behaviorally by getting ourselves trained as we have done in the month of Ramadan to be ready for the first 10 days of the Hijjah. These are the days that the Prophet ﷺ said in a beautiful hadith that is very famous and known to all of us. مَا مِنْ أَيَّامٍ الْعَمَلُ الصَّالِحُ فِي إِنَّا أَحَبُّ إِلَى اللَّهِ مِنْ هَذِهِ الْأَيَّامِ No days of the whole year. The good deeds are highly evaluated by the mighty like these days. Ya Rasul ﷺ Does that mean the days of Ramadan? Yes. Does that mean all the actions and deeds that we can do? Yes, because he said, after that, jihad Not even finding in the cause of Allah Azza wa Jal, because we know that jihad Islam, the deed of all the deeds, the highest rewarding actions is to strike in the path of Allah Azza wa Jal, to do jihad. And the Prophet said, not even find the miracles of Allah Azza wa Jalla, except a person who have left his wealth and his children and never come back after that with anything. Speaking about jihad, speaking about the ultimate rewards of, of, of actions, we remember our brothers and sisters in al Masjid al Aqsa. And I'll continue to say that, not from a nationalistic perspective, but from a religious perspective. They are doing, a job that the Muslim Ummah should all be doing. They are doing i'tikaf in al-Masjid al-Aqsa, defending the integrity of the Muslim Ummah, despite of the brutality of the, uh, the Israeli regime, which is they're known to be an apartheid regime by many human rights organizations. And I mentioned in the past the report from CDC about how the, our even government not paying attention to the brutality of the regime uh, against Palestinians. We keep them in our dua and pray to Allah and to accept from them their i'tikaf and inshallah their ibadat around the Masjid al Aqsa. And in the Masjid al The Prophet said that jihad not even finding the cause of Allah is going to be equivalent to do, to do good deed in, in these in these days, except when you go to do jihad yourself in these days and die and not never come back again. So the Prophet indicated to us what we should be doing in these days. The first eight days of the Hijjah, starting from the first day of the Hijjah until the eighth day of the Hijjah, are days you can do all the Amal Salihat and starting with As-Siyam, Sawm, fasting to Allah Azza wa Jal. And there are many uh, uh, sayings about the rewards of fasting from Allah Azza wa Jal. The first days of the Hijjah, the first eight days. There is no action rewarding, as rewarding as fasting to Allah Azza wa Jal. So it is more rewarding when it is done in the days of the Hijjah. And also, we will be fasting the ninth day of the Hijjah, which is the day of Arafah. Knowing that fasting that day will cleanse the sins of us of the year past and the year to come. Those are the first nine days of the Hijjah, and we will be exercising the Siyam fasting to Allah Azza wa Jal. However, on the 10th day of the Hijjah, fasting is forbidden because it is the day of Eid, 
and it is the day of action that is more rewarding than fasting, which is offering the qurbani to Allah Azza wa Jal. لِيَذْكُرُ صُنَّ اللَّهِ فِي أَيَّانِ الْمَعْلُمَاتِ فَكُلُوا مِنْهَا وَأَطْعِمُوا الْبَائِسِ الْفَقِيرِ ثُمَّ لِيَقْضُوا تَحَتَهُمْ وَلِيُفْرُوا ذُرَهُمْ وَلِيَطَّوْهُ بِاللَّيْتِ الْعَتِيقِ We will be slaughtering and commemorating the life of Ibrahim alayhi salam and also living the joy of those who will be enjoying their ibadat around Arafah and around Al-Mashā'ir al-Haram when they are doing the ritual of Hajj. And the days of Tashrif afterwards are the days of remembrance to Allah Azza wa Jal, which are the days, the three days to come after the first day of Eid. These days are so powerful. And as I mentioned, we need to prepare ourselves for them. One of the ibadah for the first nine days is Suyah. What else can we do? There is no limit to the ibadat or to the amal salih. Like what we used to do in Ramadan. We used to take ourselves away from this busy life and dedicate our time to worship Allah Azza If you're able to make i'tikaf in these days, nothing is wrong with that. The rewards of i'tikaf are already rewarded by Allah Azza wa You will be given the chance to fast comfortably you will be able to do more Qur'an recitation because the words in these days are highly multiplied. Every letter is multiplied by 10, up to 700, up to more because these are powerful days. And from the ibadah that we can train ourselves to do as well is to ensure that we do salaqah throughout these days. We do surah al arham we do qiyamul layl in these days. There is no limit to what you are able to do in these days. Just be mindful that they are powerful days and the actions and deeds in them will be highly rewarded and multiplied by the mighty Allah Azza wa Jal. So throughout the days of the Qarada, which is the month we're in right now, train yourself in fasting, keeping in mind that it is from an Ashrul Hurm. And fasting in Al-Ashhur al is highly encouraged by the Prophet sallallahu As he said, fast as much as you can, fast and break your fast. We need to say, fast as much as you can from the days of the of Al-Ashhur al to be able to give the words of Allah So multiply your niyyah while you're fasting in the Mondays and Thursdays or the three days or the half of the month or whatever Allah has allowed you to do. For, for in this month of fasting, keeping in mind that I'm preparing myself for the days of the Hijjah. Also, get engaged with the Quran and get yourself ready so you'll be able to finish the Quran possibly once or twice or even three times. It is a, it is a possibility that you can finish the Quran in three days so that in the, the, the 10 days of the Hijjah you'll be able to finish at least the Quran three times. Get yourself ready and to also prepare for the Uthiyah, one of the highly rewarded actions of the day of Hajj, or the day of Eid. May Allah Azzawajal Almighty help us to be able to reach these days, and may Allah Azzawajal help us to be ready to engage in them before it is too late, and before we regret and say, Ya Laytani, Qadda to the Hayati. Wa kum qawli hana wa astaghfirullah wa lakum astaghfiru, fa'akum astaghfiru. As my sister was mentioning earlier, it's not a choice for us anymore to be passive, but we need to be active. And we need to get the directions and recommendations from our community activists who are recommending to us of how we can navigate through this political, very complicated political system so that we're able to get, protect our rights, our rights for our children, and be able to maintain uh, our livelihood with integrity in this country. Also at the same time, keeping in mind that our country has an influence on the external affairs of the world and the international uh, policies of the, of, of, of the world so that we steer our government to stay and maintain its position as a human rights supported 
country. In the law, I have to use some of the other. Yeah, I do have a dinner or some of the things you want to see. All of us are going to see the Muhammad and the Muslim 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 أو علمت أحد من خوفك أو استأثرت به في علم غير علمك بأن تجعل القرآن من العظيم ويعقل بنا يا رب اللهم اجعل جماعة لقومنا وأحسن يا رحمة وحمي اللهم بارك لنا في ذي الحجة اللهم من رحمتك وكرمك وجودك بلغنا ذي الفعل أتبلغنا ذي الحجة يا رب اكتب لنا حج بيتك الحرام اللهم أعنا على الصيام في أيام ذي الحجة اللهم أعنا فيها على القيام وقراءة القرآن والصدقة وصلة الأرحام وبر الوالدين وصالح الأعمال فإنك على كل شيء قدير. ربنا أهدنا من أزواجنا وذرياتنا قرة أعين واجعلنا المتقين بها. ربي أوسع أشياء نعمتك التي أنعمت عليك وعلى والدي وأن أخر صالحا كالله وأصلح لي في ذريتي إني تبت إليك وإن لي من المسلمين. ربي أهدنا حكما وألحقني بالصالحين. واجعل لي لسان ذكر في الاخرين، واجعل لي من ورثة جنة النعيم، واغفر لوالدي وارحمهما كما ربياني صغيرا، ولا تحسني يوم يبعثون، يوم لا ينفع مال ولا ميوم، واجعلني ممن يأتيك بقلب سليم، اللهم احفظ المسجد الحرام، ومسجد نبيك محمد